I think she is the coach that has impacted the program, the conference the most. Uh, certainly, her winning seasons, number of championships has demonstrated that, you know, she really elevated all of the other ASUN conference uh, schools to elevate their programs in terms of recruiting, scheduling, and national recognition. She has represented FIU and the previous Transamerica Conference on the national uh, scale uh, in a very, very elegant way. Um, her record speaks for itself. She, she's in the top 10 in, in, in winnings in, in Division I ever, uh, and that in itself is, is just an accomplishment that, that is incomprehensible. They were extremely uh, strong powerhouse uh, during the times that she competed in the TAC and then the A-Sun. Uh, really maybe a little bit of ahead of her time in terms of um, our conference. Her, her program, her players were always bigger, stronger, faster than all the other players and in, in, uh, programs in the conference. Let me tell you something, she is one extraordinary woman. And, and her dedication, uh, hard work, competitiveness, and again, adaptability, I think is a big key word. A large part of it was recruiting. You know, we got the right kids here, the real quality kids. We, we were um, lucky in so much as we were the first really to recruit in Europe, and it was just like being at a buffet. You know, I want that one, that one, and that one. <laughs> Well, I think the, uh, the impact uh, really became most pronounced when uh, we brought back the first three young ladies from Europe. We were always competitive, and that was a credit to Cindy and the fact that financial resources were not in abundance, and, uh, and she overcame. But with the addition of, uh, of those three European girls, uh, the elevation of that program was pronounced. It was obvious to everyone in South Florida. Uh, we, we became nationally competitive and we were nationally ranked. Uh, the, uh, the thing that I remember uh, and bringing a big smile to my face at that time was that our women's basketball program outdrew the men's basketball program. We had much bigger crowds in those days. They were exciting to watch. They were, again, highly competitive and they put us on the national map. Obviously that served the university very well, but I think it also reflected very well on the conference. I can see her influence on me today, you know, every day. She helped to recruit me to the school and that helped to get, you know, allow me to graduate, you know, get a degree and now I have a job and so, you know, every day that I go to work that I'm able to go play basketball, you know, it reminds me of the impact that she has on my life. You know, she helped me go to school and that was a big thing for me and my family. You know, she, she's, she's adapted to the times. Like I said, that, that is a, a great thing. She has been a great educator, uh, always prioritized um, academics and, and making sure that our kids graduate. That was one of the recruiting spiels that, that we have. We will graduate you. That, in my opinion, yes, we have had many wins. We've had losses. We, we have done this and we have done that. But when you see the end product, uh, the kids uh, that are no longer kids, but they're young ladies uh, that leave here and go out and do well uh, for the rest of their lives, uh, that's what it's all about. And I think Cindy has been a champion in, in that area. Well, I can't imagine anybody who would be more deserving than to be in the Hall of Fame, and certainly uh, uh, she is a credit to, uh, to the Atlantic Sun Conference, uh, and like I said, in those days, the Transamerica Athletic Conference. Uh, she has been, uh, throughout her career, everything that you would want a head coach to be. Uh, she, uh, she brought nothing but pride and respect to the Florida International University Athletic Program and to the school in general, uh, and in turn brought pride and respect to the conference. Uh, so I think in, uh, in, in so many different ways, uh, she really is the epitome of what you would want to find in a, in a head coach, regardless of the sport. And uh, I'm proud to say that, uh, that I worked with her. I'm proud to say that she's my friend, and uh, we remain friends to this day.